what's up guys it's jenny and welcome back to another video today we're going to be doing paint corn so what you will need is a canvas paints and a base coat so what you will need to do to start is you will need to prep your paints and what we used is we used 50 percent paint and 50 percent fluid gel and we will link um all the materials we used in the description so, we also used a little bit of water. So what we're gonna do to start is once you mix all your paints, you need an extra cup, and then you start pouring your paints. And the base coat, you can use some of the base coat, which is what you want your canvas to mainly be. And then you'll go to the next color. And if you want it to get on the top, you can pour the paint on the side. And then you just keep doing each color. It doesn't matter how much of the color you use, but you can't use too much of it because you don't want to fill up the cup with too much of one color. So you can use a little bit of it, not too much. okay if you still have a little bit of paint left over but what we're gonna do is we're going to once you have put all your paints in the cup what you're going to do is you're going to prime your canvas and uh, we're using white because we're doing lighter colors but if you're doing darker colors you can use black but you can use whichever color but we would prefer white or black and so um, I'm going to sprinkle it on here, kind of like icing, and then you don't need a lot of paint, because a little paint goes a long way. And then, wait, where's my brush? I couldn't find my brush, so I just went ahead and got another one. And so, after you find your brush, um, and you have all the paint on here, you, what I do, there's many ways to cover it, but what I usually do is I take the brush, and I start from the corner, and do sweeps from one side to another. And you don't have to worry about there being big lobs of paint in one area, because we're gonna fix that later. Okay, now once you've covered most of the top of your canvas, um, what you do, is since there's extra paint on the top, and if there's spots that you can see the canvas, you just go over those spots with the extra paint that's on top. And then after you get all those little spots, I go around the sides. And so you don't have to do that part, that's just so it gets these parts. Now, what I'm going to do, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get some paint from the top of the canvas and then start covering the sides.
also have pleated sides and the um, top. And if you have a, some extra paint on top, if you want, you can either just keep brushing so it soaks in a little bit more, or you can go ahead and pull the paint on. I'm going to brush a little bit more and then pull the paint on. Okay, so I'm going to set my brush aside. <coughs> now I'm going to get my cup filled with the different paints in it. And then you are going to start pouring it onto the canvas. And it doesn't matter how you do it, but you just have to start pouring. And once you get to the last little bit, <laughs> um, you can start doing this because it'll get more of the paint off and it'll look better um, at the end. Um, but I just ran out of paint, but I have more in these cups. So I'm just going to put some more paint in the cup. I'm going to start try to use all the rest since I still have quite a bit of white space left on the canvas. So I'm going to try to use all the rest of the paint that's in the cups. And we don't want to waste too much of the paint. You're not going to be able to get all of it, but you have to, you should try to get as much as you can so you don't waste a lot. Okay, so now I'm just going to keep pouring. It's okay if there's about as much white space as you see on mine because um, we are going to tilt it to where it gets all the spaces. So the way we pick it up to tilt it is um, I put, well, yeah, I put four fingers on each diagonal corner and then pick it up a little bit and then start tilting and you have to try to cover all the canvas and it will run off the side too so it gets all the sides and we don't have any more gloves so we're just gonna get messy. And you can use gloves if you want. Okay, once you have it all covered on the top, if you like the way it looks, you can just tilt it a little more to where it gets the sides more, if you have a little extra space on the sides. But if you don't like how it turned out, then you can keep tilting. Now, keeping my hands over this, I'm going to check all the sides to make sure they got covered. There's a little spot right here that didn't get covered, so I can use my fingers since they're already messy. A little bit of white right here. I'm just going to. I think I got most of it. This corner has a little bit. Okay, cool. Um, so 
once you have it all have as, as you want it, if your hands got messy, then you can go ahead and wash them off. But if you use gloves, you can just go ahead and take off the gloves. And so this was Paint Porn with Jenny. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.